Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Autumn and I am back with another video. So we all know that Lil Nas X has blessed the world with yet another masterpiece. I am going to be reacting to that video because I want to and he's amazing. So yeah, I have not seen the video yet. But I have seen the memes, I've seen the comments, and I've seen his tweets on Twitter about you sensitive parents, you know. Mm. So yeah, we're gonna get into it. I'm gonna pull it up. We're gonna get into it. So this video came out two days ago as of today, so um, that's Friday, you know. Drop the glory on a Friday, always, always. So yes, I'm going to start watching and we'll see. Growing up, let me give y'all my, my little tidbit. Growing up as a Christian, I loved all of those biblical references. I mean, the snake, the garden, you, I'm, I'm assuming that that part with the stone people was kind of like cast the first stone. You know, the the, the beginning, his little like uh, monologue was about like letting yourself do what you want. Cause you know, y'all Christians, it's not just Christians. A lot of religious people, cause there are other religions out there that do the same thing. Y'all don't like for people to live their lives. like. Y'all get real pressed when people live their lives. So, I really like the video. The, it was so colorful, I love colorful videos. Every outfit that he had on was a look. The last outfit with the, um, what were those, Gucci draws? I don't know, they were, they were some type of designer draws and the boots was giving me Patrick vibes from SpongeBob with those long boots and his long legs and the movie, the SpongeBob movie. I, I like that. Now, was his hair pink or red? Because I saw a tweet of a photo that he put out when he was recording it and the hair was pink, but it's red in the video. Was it because he was in hell? Let's talk about that too. He was in hell. Okay, first of all, a lot of y'all gonna be going down hell like that. I'm just saying, <laughs> if I was going to hell, I'd go down like that too, but yeah wow wow that was nice i think that the best part of the video other than the lyrics because if you were actually listening he was talking about some real deep stuff um a little mostly very sexual i liked it though so um i don't know oh also in the like arena when he was being judged or whatever before they hit him with that rock um everybody in there was giving me hunger games uh elite vibes like katniss everdeen and the rich folks with their extravagant outfits and and i was kind of i saw a meme about it and i totally agree that his outfit resembles the one that um chris walked Chris Rock was wearing in um, oh the Fifth Element. <laughs> Took me a minute, but yeah, wow. I'm mm, that kid. He's doing no. He's not a kid anymore, Autumn. He's an adult. That young man is bringing y'all amazingness. That was a good video. I don't really have any critiques on it either, cause. It was good. I liked it. It was colorful. It was true to himself. I feel like a lot of, I've seen a lot of tweets and memes and upset parents that are mad because they're like, oh, well, he's, it's some agenda. Like, you, your kids don't have to watch this stuff. You know, you have control over what your children watch. I'm, I'm just saying, we can't parent them for you. You got to do that yourself. So, Yes, I really like that video. This was pretty short of a video, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, 
be sure to give it a thumbs up if you agree that this video was everything comment down below please no hate comments i will block you i will delete you no hate comments because he's amazing and we are here for black gay men they are doing the damn thing so all right thank you guys so much bye